How's it going, everybody? My name is Jay Dalton, and uh, I want to be a generic freaking YouTuber and do a Q&A today because I don't have anything else to upload. But before that starts, I just want to let you know, this is kind of time-sensitive time information, but uh, next week, next Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe Thursday, I'm going to be in North Carolina at Daniel Dare's Action Sports Complex, so if you're around there and you want to ride, I'll be there. After I'm done at Daniel's, I'm going to be going down to Atlanta to the Monster Energy Supercross to jump some jumps for a contest. So if you'll be there, I'll be there. On to the questions. Oh, magic, magically appearing headphones. Continuity errors, I'm sorry. Who will be first here? Let's see. Got a... I got a few. I asked you guys on Instagram story. I'm liking that thing lately. All right, this is a decent one to start. The Talking Fox. When did you start biking, and do you get paid to stay at Woodward? Like, what's the situation? Probably started. I started riding bikes when I was like four. Started going to skate parks when I was like ten or eleven, maybe around there. Now, as for the Woodward situation, I'm here working as maintenance. Pretty nice, relaxed job. I do get paid, but part of it is just. I don't, I don't really care about the money, I just care about being here, being able to ride the amazing parks, so. That's that. I run four pegs ass. Who did it? Bush did it. Now watch this drive. Of course, I mean, is there any other answer? And Justin the LBMX came in with a nice, uh, will you be my daddy? XX Joe XX4 asked, how big is the nose? Well, I don't have a tape measure on me, but, I mean, if you want to use the finger, finger length or something. I don't know. Hopefully that satisfies. <laughs> and while Spam came in with the, uh, <laughs> when was the last time you slept, man? I guess the bags under my eyes look pretty crazy, but I, I sleep eight hours a day. I don't know what the deal with that is. Oh, hair's looking insane. Yeah, I don't really know what the deal with that is. Sorry. Crankflip Charles wants a bike check and asks me if the Illuminati is real. Bike check might be coming soon, but I'm not, re not really too sure about the Illuminati. Elliot Rogers 15, do you have any sponsors? Sponsored by my local bike shop in Connecticut, Tony's Bikes and Sports, and uh, pretty much all I need right now. I mean, a travel sponsor would be sick. Sponsored by a gas station to pay for gas. Beautiful. But I'm surviving, I'm living. Sponsors are for squares anyways. Always 97. What is a trick that you really like, but also hate at the same time? Also a bike check. Bike check coming soon. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. I freaking hate bike. I, personally, I hate bike checks. I don't watch them. I think they're god. But for some reason, a lot of people want to know what the heck I ride, so it will come. Don't worry. As for the first part, what trick do I really like, but also hate at the same time? 720. You think they look sick? Can't freaking do it. Try so hard. Tried for years. Cannot do it. I don't know why. It just hates me. The trick hates me. Shad Morose is coming in with the, the philosophical, the crazy important life questions here. He asked me, Do you put the milk in before or after the cereal? After the cereal. I'm sorry if that for some reason changes how you think of me, but after the cereal, it's the only way to do it. Dang it, my freaking phone. <coughs> phone keeps shutting off. It's making this difficult. Turbo Raccoon underscore? Are you sure about sure? Sure. Toby Beeren asked me if I ever get bored of Woodward. I don't, I don't know if that's possible, but I understand what you're saying. Riding the same parks every day does get a little bit old, but there's always something new to try. There's a new line, new trick, new try to go higher on every, I don't know. There's always something else to give a shot. And when it gets warmer, there's a bunch of other parks I can ride too, other than the buildings. It's just a lot of variety here. BMX is endless opportunities, endless possibilities. So no, I don't get bored. Who's your favorite rider? Apart from me, well, Ollie, Ollie Goodwin, I was, I was gonna say you, but canceled it out. My favorite rider? I don't know if it makes sense to you or not, but Kyle Baldock. Freaking legend. Sends everything, biggest tricks, crazy as pop. I've seen a random person a few times. Doesn't make sense. I don't even, I can't, yeah. His riding is gnarly. Jack BMX? Do your parents have a nose as large as yours? Uh, I don't think so. I, I've broken mine a few times, so uh, it got a little, it got a little bit larger. Not really much I could do about that, but I'm, I've embraced it. Ryan Riley? How did you meet Spencer? Uh, I met Spencer at camp here about four, four years ago. It was both our first summer working, and uh, when you ride with people, you get to know him. He was a cool dude, so he hung out. And then he kept working at camp, kept getting to know him, and yeah, he's sick. Ben Kelly 167 who is your inspiration to start riding? Uh, there wasn't really like any specific person that made me want to start or got me to start. It kind of just happened as a natural progression. I've always ridden bikes. Like like I said, started at four. Used to jump the little 1080 ramps in front of the house. Before I was going to skate parks, I was racing motocross. So I was already really comfortable on a bike. And then when I heard, or my parents heard, they built a skate park in the town. They brought me down there a few times, started riding it. And yeah, I liked it, so I kept going. Wilbo BMX, why don't I do more stuff on the, uh, on the Nose channel? No, the video game stuff is hard. I was, I was trying to do live streams, but the connection here isn't as good as I originally thought it was. 
I'm working on it. I haven't forgotten about it. Don't worry. The Nash. How many marshmallows can you fit in your mouth while saying Chubby Bun? No. Coming from Twitter now. Jake Callot. What or who inspires your writing style? Said high airs, nose bonk, whips and dips and flips and chips, etc. Hashtag J Daltoff. Honestly, I, growing up, I, I never watched any BMX videos or anything. Like The first BMX movie I watched was the Fiend movie, and then the Market Zero. This is like the only two I've watched. <laughs> Sorry if that makes me a terrible heathen, but it's, it's just the way it is. So, so I'm not basing my style off of anybody, but I, I think it's kind of adjusted from motocross and from just watching everybody at my local park ride, because there were some awesome freaking riders riding that. I mean, it's not the greatest park, but there were a ton of sick dudes, and being able to watch them, they were super helpful. When I was younger, I was at the park, they helped me out, learn tricks, learn how to air out. Park locals, sick people. Jerry Perrin asked me, how do I really feel about clickbait titles and thumbnails on YouTube? Oh, I, 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 I actually just love them. My Twitter rants are, they're just a joke. I, clickbait is great. I love it. That's, that's all there is to say. It's just amazing. Last few. Veronica Gray came in with like, like 15 darn questions on this feed here. I'll get a couple. When's the next edit out? I don't know. I'm sorry. Would you do a collab with the Scotty Kramer crew? Possibly. Next time we're going to incline, maybe. Would you consider doing a pegless street edit? Uh, maybe. But my first street edit, I didn't really use pegs at all, so I guess it wouldn't be too much different. Let's just say the next street edit is going to be fire, though. Have I ever played RuneScape? Oh, oh, have I played RuneScape? Let's see. I found it. I found it. Here we go. Was I playing? I was playing in March when I hurt my knee. Dang, I should have finished those. But yeah, let's just say I played a little bit. Tiny, tiny bit of time on the game. <laughs> I think I'm gonna edit on the RuneScape question. That's honestly a banger. So yeah, I'm gonna cut it off here. Sorry, this is a little, little bit different. It might be a little clunky. I'm not used to doing these stupid uh, sit in my room and talk videos. But if you made it all the way through, I appreciate it. Try to add some little edits in, make things interesting. Maybe even threw some background music in there. I don't know if I did, but if I did, that's what I did. Oh. Like like all the other YouTubers, I'll plug my merch here, you know? If you want my face on your phone, the link is up there. Dang it, I always forget. It's up in that corner. Yeah, I'm, I'm committing. Committing to this corner right here. It funds the channel. If you enjoyed the questions, you learned a little bit about me, for some reason you wanted to know more stuff, drop that like, and uh, I'll see you on Tuesday with a How to Hang Five, I think. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Goodbye. Goodbye.